Let's talk to Jill Nicolini. It is. Good morning, everyone. Yeah, so some showers that we're going to point out the highlights right now of our warm temperatures to start with, okay? 45 in Somerville, 45 in Teterboro, also already 56 in Belmar, well above average. And take a look what's happening here in the city. It's already 47, 45 in Newburgh, and temperatures rising. Look at this, double digits, uh, 27 degrees in comparison to yesterday. That's how much warmer it is in Belmar, and it's up 23 degrees right now in West Hampton in comparison to yesterday. Tomorrow, different story, we're going to drop. Uh, but right now, your live radar shows some showers here, uh, basically evening out here, some Brooklyn and Queens, but mostly yeah. the left lane is squeezing by. We'll bring you more details on this as it does come in. Now, alternate side of the street parking rolls are in effect today citywide. Well, per hour winds, hold on to that steering wheel. Can't rule out a down tree or two. My goodness, uh, into the overnight, into tomorrow. Finally, the winds will die down. Again, this is tomorrow morning. We're talking gusts still up to 20 miles per hour. Uh, but by Tuesday afternoon, things will die down. Let's take a look. Also, oh. quiet conditions of the Holland, but wet road conditions, urging everyone to take it slow this morning and allow yourself for some extra travel time. Now we had no overnight construction here. Everything is open. Similar situation at the Lincoln and at the George. You are delay free at all three of these. Hudson River crossings, uh, but not too much longer because rush hour takes place very soon. And again, we'll have more on this and of course your weather in under 10 minutes. Now back to you. Don't have a camera shot here, but most of them are fogged out to be honest with the rain. Uh, so periods of rain for today and we're talking about some gusty winds up to 40 miles per hour. Uh, a lot of Halloween, uh, excuse me, Halloween holiday decorations are out. So you may want to definitely tie them up more securely. Uh, some down trees potential for today into tomorrow as well. Now temperatures though above average. So look, we're at 48 degrees right now uh, and your normal high is 47. So we're already well above that. Colder air though, unfortunately returns by tomorrow, at least a 15 degree temperature change. And keep in mind tracking this possible snowflakes in store for Wednesday, but not too much moisture. We're not talking about a real snow event, but it'd be nice to have that southerly flow. And that's why we are experiencing warmer than normal conditions. And taking a look, we'll slow down for a second, Joe, uh, in terms of rainfall totals so or so uh, across the five boroughs or poor Portions of the five boroughs. Some areas about two tenths of an inch will have those updated mm -hmm. gusting. So here's a look at the day planner. We do anticipate a high of about 62 degrees. So much, Stacey Ann. Good morning, everyone. Checking in with the roadways here. We do have an unauthorized truck uh, right on the Southern State Parkway. So westbound at Route 106. <laughs> Good morning. I uh, love the change of the seasons, right? We get sick of it. Thank goodness we live here. We get a little bit of everything. George Washington Bridge. Right Stacey Ann, checking in with the traffic here. The West Side Highway. We have a collision and southbound 79th Street. Some very heavy delays from this. Uh, back up to the George Washington Bridge. Oh, yeah. Some puddles to have to contend with for sure. Yeah, the roads were pretty rough as well. Taking the Long Island Expressway in today, but. Uh,